Welcome to my first video on my vlog channel. I wanted to share my setup with you all. This is where I spend most of my time. Whether it be doing editing, streaming, or gaming, I spend most of my time at my desk. I get a few questions surrounding my setup, so let's jump into it. Starting with my desk itself, it was made by my dad out of an old fire door and the legs are from an old dining room table that we didn't use anymore. So I chose to go with the color grey for my desk as I knew that I was going to have a really dark setup and most of my stuff would probably get lost if it was like a black table. So I ended up going with having a grey one instead. The next thing that's probably one of the most important things on my setup, or should I say on my setup, is my Mac Mini. I have a 2020 Mac Mini that I dedicate to all of my creative work. I decided to go with the Mac Mini when COVID happened, when my MacBook Pro that I had since back in high school wasn't keeping up with my music mixing and mastering. I did some research on what would be the best kind of MacBook for me and I ended up going with the 2020 M1 Mac Mini. Mine has 16 gigs of RAM and one terabyte of space on it. I do have my mounted under my desk to free up some space on my desktop. I got my mount off Amazon, everything will be linked below. As for a keyboard and a mouse, I use an Apple Magic Keyboard with the numeric keypad as I use the numeric keypad for shortcuts in Logic. I use an Apple trackpad because it was the easiest transition from my MacBook Pro. Um, I also don't enjoy using the Magic Mice that much, I find them really difficult to use. As for headphones, I pretty much only use my Audio Technica ATH M50s. These are pretty standard closed back flat sound headphones in the music industry. I've used them for everything from mixing, mastering, even for gaming. I haven't gone back to any other kind of headphone after using these for my university course. These have a lovely dynamic range and I highly recommend them. Another really important thing for music making is an interface. I use a Focusrite Scarlett 6i8 which means 6 inputs and 8 outputs. I have monitors that I like to use for checking my mixes out loud. I have the option for two headphone jacks in the front. This is just in case I have a client come over and I do some recording with them, they're able to plug in their own headphones. Next up I have my boom arm for my mic. This is a Thorn Max boom arm. This is an upgrade that every streamer needs. It's so smooth and doesn't make any noise when I move it around. Following this I have my microphone. I have an Audio Technica 2040 XLR microphone. This is a dynamic broadcasting microphone. I've had mine for just over a year now and I've used it not only for vocals but for guitar recording as well. Now for all my music nerds out there, this is my baby. This is my Moo Grandmother. It's a semi-modular analog synthesizer. I use this for all kinds of things, but mostly to play around and get a cool sci-fi sound when making music. One of my most important things I always use when I'm making music is my Yamaha Pegro MP32 MIDI keyboard. I use this to compose large-scale orchestral pieces or to simply be a controller for MIDI instruments on tracks. Now, before I fail to mention, I have bearing a Truth B1030A active speakers. These are secondhand from my high school. Um, this is a good thing as I was familiar with the sound already and I didn't have to get used to the sound of a new set of speakers. Now, let's get into where the fun begins. <laughs> Gamers, I know why you're all here and it's to see my epic gaming setup. This is my gaming and streaming rig that I use. It's a base pre-build from Sculpt Tech called the Phantom 3070 Ti Gaming PC, but I've made a few small modifications to it, so let's get into it. This bad boy runs a Ryzen 5 3600 CPU. The motherboard is a Gigabyte B450M Wi-Fi motherboard. It has 16 gigs of RAM, though I would like to double that. As the name suggests, it runs a 3070 Ti graphics card. I have 5 terabytes of space on this beast, consisting of two 2 terabyte HDDs and one terabyte SSD. I have a 650 power supply keeping this guy running. As for my keyboard and my mouse, I use a Razer Viper Ultimate for my mouse, and for my keyboard, I use a Razer Black Widow Mini Hyper Speed. Now for audio, I use my same ATH M50Xs, but for my interface I use the Razer Audio Mixer. This allows me to mix on the fly when I'm live or just hanging out with friends over Discord. 
Now, like every other streamer, I do have a stream deck. I do rock the 15 button stream deck and this works just fine for me. I am also a part of the three monitor gang with my main monitor being the Asus 27 inch display. For my left monitor, I have the Philips 23.5 inch display monitor. And on top we have the Acer Nitro 24 inch monitor. And we have now made it to the end of the video and I would like to say a huge thank you for hanging around for this long and remember to always stay connected and I will see you next time.